Hi, everybody. Hi, chicken. Hi. Uh, so we're actually leaving Disney's Beach Club Resort right now because we just had some beaches and cream. We decided to have ourselves some uh, grilled cheeses, tomato soup, keep it nice and light. Mm -hmm. It wasn't light at all, though. It was not light at all. Delicious, but quite stuffed. Yeah, full. I had the grilled cheese with bacon and french fries, perfect, with the vanilla root beer. <laughs> and uh, she had like the classic grilled cheese with tomato soup. It's hot today, so I try to avoid the tomato soup. But we want to put something in our stomachs because we are about to head over to Wilderness Lodge. And we're going to have ourselves a little treat. They have this skull flight. Skull. S-K-U-L-L. -L, flight. It's like a margarita flight. And it's out for a limited time, I guess, for Halloween. Uh, we saw it on Disney Food Vlog, so we figured that looks good. I'm never annoying. Conditions, I'm never annoying. I do love you unconditionally. No, I always do. But I'm never annoying. Let's get that right. So anyway, here we are at the Wilderness Lodge. And we're heading over to the Geyser Point Bar and Grill because they have something called the Skull Flight. Oh, the moose tracks on the floor. Yeah, there's moose tracks. She just goes, I love the moose tracks. So we're heading over to Geyser Point to get this thing called the Skull Flight. <sighs> it's five o'clock somewhere. Oh, one of our favorite resorts. We haven't stayed here together yet. Mm -hmm. The Wilderness Lodge. Wow, I queued up with the music coming in perfectly. Oh, right, the bathroom. <laughs> Go ahead. Yeah, one day I'm just gonna come here and like just edit. Just sit here all day and just edit because I just love like the aesthetic, the place itself. There's like a lot of cool nooks and crannies around where you can kind of just sit down and do some work. <laughs> now that we relieved ourselves, we'll take a little tour around the Wilderness Lodge. Going, babe. Where, where are you leading me? Oh, damn, that's beautiful. Like I said, one day I'm just gonna set up right here and just do all my editing work. Maybe I'll get a remote job just so I can work here, <laughs> like work out of here. Yeah. Hopefully we'll go to club level. And one day we'll get to club level. And then we can show you that. Someday my club will call. Yeah. What? Okay, I'm coming. It's just a really cool thing too. It just very, like just brightens up the place. Literally, the stairs are all lit up with like LED strip lights. It's just like a really nice touch. Brings a little bit of glamor into the rustic feel of the Wilderness Lodge. Oh no! It's closed! Yeah, we're gonna see the day. Damn! I love this resort. Oh, you love the resort? Yeah. <laughs> I love it. No, I love it too. It's beautiful. Relaxing, mm -hmm. lively, fun, educational. immersive, educational. That's right, babe. Look at that. That's gorgeous. I love this spot here. Oh, you do? Bring one of our games. You can buy the oh, you could buy the yeah. The we could do a nice Pirates of the Caribbean battleship like, right the here. Walt Disney World game. Yeah, or oh, the Walt Disney World game. Cute. Outside on the balcony here. Stairs. I saw the details in the stairs, but look at that. That's pretty uh, pretty cool. Chandelier. 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 Oh, going outside. Let's do it. Viewing area is open between 7 30. Ow, just let the door hit me in the face. <laughs> I was trying to grab it from you. Resort is very similar to Animal Kingdom. Yeah. I believe it's the same architect. Oh, do you? Yeah. That's why there's a was lot of. Was it Joe Rhodes? No, I don't oh. think so, but there are a lot of different hidden spots that you can explore and relax. So, that's what I really like about it. Oh, yeah, is that what you. Yeah. And up there, there's some rooms up there. The balcony underneath that canopy up there, so that's gotta be a great room. Oh, you're not crazy about it? No, oh, thanks. I actually stayed up there. Yeah, oh, did you? And I just don't like that you can't see when you're sitting. Like, oh, if you're sitting down, there's like yeah, not much to, you gotta like anything. stand up to look over uh -huh. the yeah. thing here where it's kind of like just all open. That's the only thing. It's beautiful though. Yeah. 
Enjoy your rock. All right, let's roll. Oh, the spot opened up. The spot. Like any time you come to Wilderness Lodge, there's the spot. And we're going to the spot right now because there were people here before. Oh, but the spot is open. Look at this. This is beautiful. You look pretty, babe. You always do, but this is nice. What are you heating up for? It's 95 degrees outside. We're in the spot. Because nobody's here now. Nap time. But we got margaritas to drink. After the margaritas, hopefully nobody's here. Guess we'll find out. I do feel the heat because it's a fire. I, I know. It's scary. No. All right, we can't be too lazy yet. We'll get lazy after the margaritas. Or the skull flight. Skull flight just sounds better. It's a skull flight. I know the music is fantastic. It's very pretty. It's a place, right? No, you. <laughs> and you do match the resort very well. I know. <gasps> Look at this view. Copper Creek Falls. Oh, baby? Do you want to go up there? Let's go up there. Let's go take a little, little trip. I guess we're working off the grilled cheese yeah. before the margaritas. Before our skull flight. Skull flight. I'm just going to say it like that every time. When I order it, I'm going to tell him I want a skull flight. I'm going to do it even harder. Like, can I have the skull flight? This is pretty. You know what's not gonna be so pretty? The skull flight! <laughs> oh, she just left me. That was one too many skull flights. And she decided to walk away. You know, I hate that those like kid play areas, they don't never let me in. Gotta be 48 inches or under. What's that about? Yes? She wants me to point out how beautiful it is over here. And it is. It is gorgeous. She said the view outward is just as beautiful as the view inward. Fact. Where's the interesting fact? Wait, 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 wait. When you're on the boat, when you're go on ahead. The boat, Don't get shy now. When you're on, a, on the boat, out uh -huh. there. Oh, out there. And you look up. And all you look up. up at the top, okay. You can actually see a bear face. Oh. Made out of the architecture. Oh. And it's supposed to be uh, Humphrey the Bear. Interesting. Actually, was by. All right, heading to Geyser Point Bar and Grill for a skull fight. Flight. You can't even say it right. You can't even pronounce it right. Skull fight. Yes, babe. It's called a skull fight. Sorry, I was worried about walking into the nest. <laughs> yeah, I think I swallowed one. <gasps> Geyser Point. This is the home of the Skull Flight. <laughs> okay. Skull Flight. You sound like my friend Matt. Oh, I would love to try the Skull Flight. Oh, that's right. He loves skulls. Oh, I have an obsession with skulls. Stop off for some more running water. And periodically, that geyser will explode. Will guys hence guys are point where we're gonna get the skull flight <laughs> skull flight that's cool that's cool thank you, there you go. thank you so much the skull, the skull flight yeah. all right oh. all right so down below i'm gonna go ahead and list what each one is let's start off where do you want to start because here's the skull that's the skull that's the skull right there. Where do you want to start? You want to start work our way to the skull? Okay, so light to dark. Light to dark? Yeah. 
we're gonna work our way from light side to dark side. It is pumpkin. So it's pumpkin. Mm -hmm. Okay. I, she, she gave us like a rundown of what each drink was, but I didn't catch all of it. So I like I'm gonna it. put it in the description. Oh yeah. Oh, that's good. It's refreshing. I taste honestly like an alcoholic pumpkin spice. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. That's like fall in alcohol. Clean the palate. Next. Take a real sip. Drink it. I forget what you said. It's faulty. Well, let's see if I can fall through this special. It's good. Oh, really? No, not really. No? It's because you don't take oh, a big I enough sip. Cranberry. Maybe. Mm. Guess Maybe we'll find out. Go yeah, ahead. Hey, this, this, one's apple. this one's definitely apple. I'm excited for this one. I love apple. I love banana. Mm. That one's good. But apple. That's apple. -y. We were saying these kind of remind us of like the quarter drinks, yeah. those little barrel drinks, or even like those long icicle pops. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. You have no idea. She's not. She's I not paying am. attention. No, I am. I'm just reading the description. Okay. Mm. This one is. This is around the pumpkin patch. This is the blood orange. Around the pumpkin patch, blood orange, apple. Um, poison apple. Poison apple. Like you said, and, it tastes like a sour apple. Mm -hmm. And the skull one is the black magic. And this is the black magic, but it's apple based. Let's move on to the black magic. Ladies first. And this is the one with the skull. Wow. I think that's my favorite. Yes, that's my favorite. All right. That is the good one. The black magic wow. is my favorite. Is it? Yeah. Yeah. The yeah. So Black Magic is amazing. The Spooky Signature Libations, Halloween Margarita Flight, that's what we got. So the Black Magic Margarita, pepper infused yes. lime juice. That's, what that's I taste. Yes. So good. Reminds me of, What's the color? The reminds color me? reminds me of when you use watercolor paints. Yeah. And you clean your brush and all the colors get mixed up. That's okay. the color you get. Okay. Okay, so now I'm gonna kind of just rearrange them and like I said, the order that I find them best, it's not the best. And I'm just gonna simply do, take this pumpkin, put it here. Favorite is the Black Magic with the pepper infused something, the pumpkin one, the sour apple, or the poison apple, and then the blood orange. I think that's how yeah, I, same. same thing. Same, but cheers. You know, oh, actually, you know what this pumpkin one reminds me of? The pumpkin juice from Harry Potter World, if it had alcohol in it. That is like it to a T. Yes, that is what it tastes like. I tried it when we went that one time. <laughs> okay. So while I was chugging this black magic here, I noticed I got these little things on the bottom here. I don't know if that's like the pepper or what that is, but that's pretty cool. <laughs> Drink the most fast. It's gonna hit you. That's one thing about it. What? Don't sip your liquor. And that's one of the assumptions. You get, you taste the sweets and you think it's like, oh my god, you're gonna hit you. Fine. Yeah? It, it's gonna hit you. You're drinking some smell. It's <laughs> you like it? Yeah, I like it. What's your favorite? I'm a fan of sugary drinks. Like, I like craft cocktails. I like sugary drinks. And these are craft, but I, I don't do so well with the, um, with the sugar stuff. I love the sugar stuff. Yeah, he thinks it's like drinking a regular drink. <laughs> it's candy. With alcohol. I don't even drink. So we really had just an amazing flight at a geyser point. We got to talk to our bartender, Cecilia, who gave us a lot of great Disney knowledge. Um, but more importantly, the flight, I definitely recommend. It was like $18. You can buy each drink individually, so we may come back and buy the Black Magic just by itself. Each individual drink is $12. Otherwise, you could buy the whole flight for $18. So 
I definitely recommend getting the flight, see what you like, and then if you like something, go with the uh, a drink. What, babe? What? What? The geyser! It's geysing! <laughs> wow. Get a little wet. Whoa! Oh! Cool. Oh yeah, so we're heading back inside now. It's got a little gray out, it is Florida. You know, I think we're six or seven months in, so we're kind of used to that. Nice short day today. I think we're gonna go to this home store. Oh, the gnats again. Ugh, we're still, they're still going. Anyway, pretty. We're going to like this home decor store. I'm gonna find some home decor obviously um but we always love it at the wilderness lodge and hopefully one day we'll get to stay here bathroom break no problem i'll just stay here and rock look at this artwork I mean, that's just awesome one thing i noticed too there's like a little compass on that wall there and it says open and close, but I have no idea what I'm doing. I have no idea what's opening and what's closing. Okay, that's close. And I'm trying to open it. Nothing opens. All right, okay. I didn't do it. I didn't break anything. I have no idea what's going on. Where's chicken? All right, like I said, that's just about to do it from one of our favorite resorts. Yet we haven't stayed here yet. I feel like this is like one of the only ones we haven't stayed at that we said we want to stay at. That's part of our favorites because every resort is our favorite for some reason or another. But I feel like this one is something that we... Something this has got to be like the next bucket list one. Yeah, something yeah. magical about this one. It's just, but you know what? I feel like it's a better time to stay here during the uh, cooler months. Because it kind of gives you that warm fall feel with all the like fires the and feeling. the holiday feeling. During Christmas time, it's decorated immaculately. Right. So, uh, I'm not slurring my words. So, we're going to get in the car. And like I said, we're going to go get some decor for the home. Ow, why are you bumping into me? Oh, we didn't go to the store that you wanted to go to. That's okay. Oh. You wanna go back to the store? No. Good, I didn't think so. Anyway, until next time, let us not lose sight of one thing, that it all started with a man behind a mouse. And it continues with mouse We hope to see you real soon. Mm -hmm.